this. So understand what uh, the concerns I have as a citizen here in Santa Clara County. I was able to process the, uh, hey! What's up, bud? Hey, they told me you were headed over to the DA's office. They took my bullhorn. I know, okay, I told you. Pulled from my cell phone. Did, did I tell you? Did I give you a lot of warnings? Look at this. Did I tell you that was going to happen? But, but, you know, you got to realize where I'm coming from right here. The, the but did I tell you that was going to happen? They're just not listening to anybody. I they're know, not, but, but, they're that, but, to but I told you that wasn't the right way to go about it, right? That's the county level. So this is what I did. I filed my own lawsuit. So I filed my own lawsuit against the city and the PD. Okay. You know, so I went the whole route to do it the right way. You okay. Know? But it's just sad that members of the public have to do this. I know. But take the it's right a bad steps. Poli I've gone all the right direction. I know. I and know. Then you know what Chief Garcia put on there? He put will reoffend. So they were going to send me to Elmwood, and it was supposed to be just they put me in jail. He put I me heard. in jail. Okay. I heard. I was gone, but I heard. And, and you know, I mean, I've talked about this at the supervisor meetings. I talked to you about the mayor yesterday. The leadership here is out of touch with reality. It is. And, and you know what? I'm going to be I know. coming out here as much as I can. I know, but you guys Scott, are good guys, but the leadership doesn't know what he's doing. I know, but Scott, do it the right way. This I don't want you right ended way. up in jail again. I don't want you losing your equipment. I don't, I've got more equipment. Of, of all more you know, I've always been supportive of your right to do whatever it is you need to do, right? But I don't want you to go. Uh, I don't know. Well then, I don't. But that's the right way too. That's the right way too. The right way, but I mean, losses. I know. I mean, I'm a working man. But if they're not hearing this right here, this story is your pay, your pension, your salary for somebody having to go this route, as opposed to just going through that lobby and finding the right way. You kind of see what I'm saying? Because filing the lawsuit. It's just Scott. He's fine. He's just recording a statement. No. Hey, how you doing, bud? Brother, good man. So, so we got it all. We got it all good, Sarge. Should we know what we're talking about here? Yeah. Can you be here at all? Or? Yeah, he's got. There's no. There's no violation. He's just reporting his statements. <laughs> he got. Uh, he got booked for a loud volume and stuff. Uh, what was it? Two weeks ago over the Christmas uh, break. Yeah, about two weeks ago. What about restraining yeah. order? Uh, no restraining order. Not right he's now. Out here exercising. If there's anything he hasn't been served, rights, so guys, check and see so. if there is anything. But I don't think there's. Still trying to get my property back. I really didn't want to file a lawsuit against the yeah, city we'll, and the we'll PD. Got, you know, so it's, is there anything active on him? Nobody served you with a restraining order when you. Uh, restraining order. Why? <laughs> well, because the if you get the keep up the bullhorn, that was the other thing that we're going to talk about doing is getting a restraining it's order. Getting a restraining order. Yeah, that was, that, and that was exercising my constitutional rights out here. I'm not. Uh, right. you know, I'm not doing anything wrong, guys. This is America. I know. But remember, you and I talked many times about it. There's a right way and a wrong way. As long as you cover within the lines, you're good to go. And filing when a lawsuit were, against the city, that big giant Chief Garcia is the right way to go. Right. I want to prevent doing things like this. Because this takes away from your guys' pension, salary, and everything. A lawsuit like this affects the other officers. Right. Why can't they fix the process in there so people can get their property back? And then you guys can stop stopping people like me out here. And this crap is, is absurd. The, the uh, policy of not releasing people's property would you get for an attorney? Or are you just doing that on oh, your own? They, you, know, you know, when you get on EBT, you get a $500 fee waiver. They, they, I figured out exactly how to do it, file the lawsuit. Right. But it's sad I have to go about it that way. I just wanted my property back. There's my father's ashes, my tools, stuff in my locker room, and that's all I wanted back. And I don't think filing a lawsuit against the PD to get Do you stuff have an back attorney that kind of helps you out with this? Um, I actually filed the whole lawsuit myself. Okay. Maybe an attorney might be able to dig in a little bit deeper than you, you know? Although you do have rights, but what I'm saying is you need another source that can kind of get around all the, all the suggestion, all the suggestion of restraining orders. See, the San Jose Police are they will get a restraining order against you, and they By will, all means, okay, and they will. Right. But what will happen is that just going to slow you down. Well, so I mean, if you guys feel that's necessary and you feel that I'm a threat, I've always liked.